This episode of Strange Love brought to you by Treasure Licious. Good evening. This is Strange Love, and I'm your host, Cami Chaos. Welcome, babies. Hi, I'm Cami Chaos, and welcome to a very, very special edition of Strange Love. This week, as always, I'm joined by my co-host, Mr. Chaos. But this, Hello. This time we have something super extra special going on. We're joined by three lovely ladies um, far, far, far away. Would you guys all like to say hi and introduce yourselves? Hello, I'm Jo Befoy. Hello. Hi, Joe. Hi. Hi. And how are Hi, you? Hi, I'm Beth. <laughs> <laughs> you have to let them talk now, sweetie. <laughs> okay. Are we going with the introduction still? Yes. Should we do that? Yes. Okay. Hi. I'm Belle. Hello. <laughs> Hello. And I am Holly Ireland. I have a British accent. You might have known me from other British accents, like very similar to Joe and... Bill, you know, <laughs> it's very hard to tell us apart, I think. That'll be because you're my twin. That's right. <laughs> oh, it's Holly. Okay? I, I think that Mr. Chaos is Holly. going to do that for the whole show, too. It's so <laughs> splendid to hear Holly again. It's because we all talk like that we over here. Talk. Yeah, everybody oh, does. Oh, very smart. Okay, yeah. I think so. <laughs> say quite right quite right i've been suppressing it up to now but i think i'm going to get to the closet i think you'll find that we don't have closets in england (laughs) (laughs) darling i've kept myself in the wardrobe (laughs) wardrobe much better okay so before we devolve into you know further Fits of giggling. I'm ready to devolve. <laughs> Mr. Chaos is ready to devolve. He he can't. He has to remain somewhat present because we have another show to do later today. However, holy crap! Holy crap! Wow! Let's get the whole Give where your crap. where your blog resides out of the way. So, Holly. Yes. Yes. Hello, Holly. Okay. Yes, hello, I'm fake I'm Holly. Holly. I'm on top. Okay. okay. I'm gonna talk like this the whole show. Oh, that would be hot. I'll talk like this, and you guys talk however it is that you guys are going to talk. Holly, why don't you tell us where your little blog is? Well, my blog is is a quaint little place, Holly's Never Everland, (laughs) blogspot.com. And has that changed since the last time you did the show? Quite right. Has that changed? Did that change since the last time you did my little show? I don't believe it has, no. Oh, are you sure? Because you used to have a different blog. Yes, I used to be found at... What the hell? What the hell? <laughs> Somewhere else. <laughs> Somewhere else. I believe else. it was Holly and her stupid peculiar thoughts dot com or something. <laughs> really, really stupid. But then we had a vote. And we decided it would be called Holly's Never Everland dot blogspot dot com. Thank you to Lean Dalu at Wits End for helping me to name my blog. This is actually really hurting my throat, so um, now no, I'm, you must I'm do it all the time. Now. How about you do some yeah. other little accent? Like you sound like some, uh, you know, random American gal. Um, <laughs> I can't do random American just at the minute because I've had just a little bit too much cocktail, but I could do... You sound, so like, a, to, you sound like a so random American I, gal right now. Yeah, well, that, yeah, okay, that was pretty random. But I could go, um... Can you do Welsh? Oh, Lush. Can you do Welsh? As long as the only thing I have to say is, oh, Lush, <laughs> then I can be Welsh. Lush. Yeah, yeah. Um, or <laughs> if I could say, the only gay in the village, <laughs> then I could do that. Excuse That's right, yeah, because Little Britain, yeah? Yeah, the only gay in the village. That's oh, right. My family. Yeah, I think that we should <laughs> I, I think that we should move on to, to Belle now and find out what yeah. Belle's blog is. <laughs> okay, my blog is Belle hyphen diaryofahousewife.blogspot.com. 
dot com. Now do it in your real voice. <laughs> that is my real voice. <laughs> oh, that wasn't fake. Would you like me to do it in a different accent now? Oh, oh. I could do if you like. <laughs> that was very nice. I keep forgetting I'm doing a sure southern enough. accent today. I, 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 I kind of like that one. Yeah. <laughs> oh wait. Yeah, I like that too. My name is Bond. <laughs> James Bond. The trouble is that I'll forget which accent I'm doing, and by the end of the night, I'll be talking different accents. That, that'll <laughs> be that just fine right with now? us. Yeah, that'll be fine with us. We like that over here in the South. <laughs> I'll try. <That's> Portland. <laughs> Portland. But I'll end up in Belfast. No, I won't. I'll end up in Somerset, because I always end up in Somerset. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we need to move on to Joe Bouffois. Hello. Hi, Joe. <laughs> Joe Bouffois. I like how you said that. That was lovely. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I'm. I'm trying to think. Do I need to do an accent? You, can you go Glaswegian? I, I, I can do general Scottish, maybe. Do it. <laughs> I don't know if I can say my word. Just I can't spell in that though. No. Why don't oh, you just go ahead and say? <laughs> just go ahead and say your <laughs> blog address like you normally okay, would. Uh, okay. It's JoeBuffoix dot com, which is J O B E A U F O I X dot com. Um, but I, I don't know about Scottish. I'll have to have a think about that. And you'll know you found her blog I'll if you see a, a giant Scottish, Scottish accent? Scottish accent. Is that all right? Scottish? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Is that okay? Excellent. Okay. <laughs> Why is that hot? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Chaos is just a little bit more, too happy but, over there. <laughs> David, it's David Tennant. It's gorgeous. Oh. Absolutely gorgeous. We still yeah. might be oh, are we going to talk about <laughs> David Tennant now? Because I, I can talk about David Tennant now. He's and lovely. Hey Holly, you know why he why why the I got to get rid of the accent. I'm sorry. Do you, do you <laughs> oh, know yeah. why he um, why the Doctor Who museum is in Cardiff? I finally oh, found I out. I really ought to know. I is found out pub, why. Is this a pub quiz? This is not a pub quiz. It could be, but I Wait, found out me, why. Let me guess. Is it because uh, David Tennant's great great grandfather um, led the revolution against the. What's a Welsh thing? Um, uh, the Brains Beer Factory, and their f- no, I got nothing no. here. With the help of the Daleks. <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm afraid the reason that it, there's a Doctor Who museum in Cardiff is because they film it there. Mostly. No, no, it's because that's where they made the TARDIS. That's where TARDIS technology comes from. Sure. It's yeah. It's true. Because that's a fact. They have flying boxes. In do in you Cardiff. not have those in the states? No, because oh. we have the, you know, the, blue, in my other purse. the blue police boxes. All the policemen around here have blue police boxes that they can pop into. You know, it's yeah. kind of like a canteen thing. It's it's quite handy because it looks really little yeah. on the outside, but when you go in, <laughs> but this only works if you're a real policeman. Oh. Or Doctor Who, well, obviously. I'm going to move over there and become a real police officer. I think you should, so that I can. Only you'd have to be you'd have to be a WPC. Yes, which okay. means. We've uh, we've Never been mind. serenaded by Belle's phone, um, oh. and I have to say, it's the Beatles. It's, yeah, and I, I I don't know. Um, it was the Beatles. Yeah, help, help. Yeah, help. It's perfect. I need somebody. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm not allowed to sing. Wait, I'm not allowed to sing on the show. It's, I start. Oh no, you should sing. I've oh, been well, asked. You know what? Not we thought sing. of something today. You can sing, mm-hmm. and Cammy, even you can sing if you do it. In the club style. <laughs> in the club style. <laughs> yeah. Well, the club style is okay. What's what's it's the song? Vic, Vic Reeves and Bob Mortimer, isn't it? Um, yeah. If we tell them the song, we'll know. We have to. You have to do one, and then we'll have to guess. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. This well, club that's style. Not, well, you see, that's a, that's a real club style, but this is this is yeah. But like, no, give us a song so that so that if we say it, then we sing okay, it and they'll um, get it. I will yes. survive. Oh, I okay. think I understand. Oh, right. oh, that's a hard one. Oh, okay. yeah, that is quite hard. No, it needs to be something a bit more. Um, like, oh, so, I, so do you just speak the song? Oh. So you're tr- you're trying to be you're trying to be Tom Waits on the toilet. I'm sorry, I think no. Skype's just gone no. out. What's what's going on? <laughs> I think he's scaring. <laughs> I just sang Unchained Melody in the club style. Oh, Is I don't like the, I don't like the club style. It no, hurts yourself. me. It makes me You're not supposed to. It makes me like afraid it. someone's going to have a bathroom problem. That's the club <laughs> style? Well, actually, now that you mention it, I do have to excuse myself for a second. 
No, I don't. Uh huh. What's the club sure. style? I'm I'm the gonna I'm style. gonna pour myself another drink while I sit here talking to you. Would you like to tell me what you're drinking? Nope. Um, we're drinking made up drinks actually. Uh, yeah, the best it all kind. went a bit wrong, so we just bought colorful things. <laughs> They just look nice, so we chose them, didn't we? I printed off that, and I had every intention of getting everything on that list. I wanted Tidy Mo Margaritas. I wanted Painkillers. I wanted Mickey Tickies. Mickey, Mickey Tiki. Tiki. Yeah, and I, I... How many times did I go through my car, Joe? Yeah, about eight. I, I, I literally... I, the car was actually a different car at one point. Yeah. It's, it's a Toyota <laughs> Yaris. Other people's car. <laughs> yeah, Every car in the car park. Yes, yes. Scary. One girl went really indignant, and I think she tried to punch me. Yeah. <laughs> you blocked her. Yeah. yeah. Really good. Yeah. Oh, there. yeah. Well, I have, a, uh, I have a green belt in jiu-jitsu. Uh-huh. So, um, yeah. Um, what... <laughs> so what's right, in okay, your pretty drink? Some... Right, we've, we've made some up. <laughs> Well, tell so, me the made-up uh, name and what's in it. A Brookshield bogey. Oh. <laughs> it's green. Uh huh. It's it's um blue karate and Malibu. Hello, <laughs> dude. Do you have Van Halen over there or something? What what the hell's <laughs> going on? Van- They're in a hotel. <laughs> They're gonna trash it. That's what it sounded like. It what 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 it sounded like what? Like you're trashing the hotel. We uh, well actually. We oh are. no, no! One of us had to um, go out in the hallway. But you know, if you want us to, we could trash the yeah. hotel. Should we trash the hotel? We spilt my <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Trashing a, the hotel, sponsored by Treasurelicious. Treasurelicious.com. <laughs> Send the bills to Treasurelicious. <laughs> Display your treasures oh. on the web at Treasurelicious.com. <laughs> I wonder if we take that oh. too far sometimes. Maybe I should put my alcohol in Treasure Licious. Yeah. Well, I am going to. I got a new mixer. It cost me five ninety nine, eight mm. ninety nine. I'm going to put that in that Treasure is Licious. The is that what that is? There? It is. Yeah. yeah, I know nothing. That's yeah. lovely. Isn't it gorgeous? It's pretty. Does it do anything to you? It makes me all tingly. Okay, Holly, what are you drinking? I am drinking. I was supposed to actually be drinking the um, Brick Shield bogey Mm -hmm. because you had the um no you had toxic waste no you had toxic waste (laughs) (laughs) but then you had no what was the other one I don't know Dr. Feel Good Dr. Feel yes I had Dr. Feel Good Dr. Pepper's in it that's right Dr. Pepper zero Mm. zero something calories but plenty of taste anyway Joe is a master cocktail mixer I gotta tell you because she I got a Malibu rum and a uh, blue caracho uh-huh. and this f- Gaia freaking guava what the hell are you oh that's um, good that and mixes well I let her be in charge of it while I was tending to something else I don't know it tastes freaking gorgeous I gotta tell Isn't you it nice? oh you my god it? would you have I tried it that's the second one I've down <laughs> <laughs> so a See, she, just, she just opened it and just slipped into her own glass and didn't share. That's just rude. Oh. I am rude, isn't it? <laughs> no say shame. it, say it, say That's it. It's just so rude. Yeah. I love it when Joe says I'm rude. It's so cute. She told me to shut up today. You told me to shut up. Okay, well. Oh my god, it's so cute when she says shut up. <laughs> tell, us, tell us all to shut up, Joe. Isn't she cute? Yeah. Shut up. <laughs> I say it in London, shut up. Yeah. All right? That's shut right. Up. Now, so now do the Scottish. I don't. Oh, wait, 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 let me think. Scottish, shut up. No, I can't do it. Go back to the they say? They, may, they, don't, they, they might not say that. No. Say it like, um, go shut your face. <laughs> That's, something <not> nice. <laughs> That's just something not nice. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, we have two more two more drinks to get out of the way. Oh. Belle, what are um, you drinking? Oh. <laughs> I'm going to pretend to be Bill. Oh, gosh. No, I'm Belle vacated. Oh, no. To be sure, now I'm drinking wine. I think it might be a bit pink. I'm not really sure. It was white, and then it was red, and they wanted to make it green, but I didn't think that green wine would be very wise, and I don't know what accent I'm talking on now. It seems to have changed. You're very, very friendly with that microphone. Why don't you back up off the microphone a little bit? I'm afraid you're going to start licking it soon. No, we won't go there. Oh, you need some more drink, though. I don't know where oh. my drink is. Oh. Well, while they're oh, sorting yeah. out their drinks, I'll tell everyone what I'm drinking. This yeah. evening, yeah. Cammy Chaos is enjoying a lovely piñosa. It's much like a mimosa, 
But you replace the orange juice with pineapple juice. It gives it a nice tropical feel, and you still get the sparkling from the Spanish cava. <laughs> nice! Yeah! Oh, I, I turned off the music. I'm having a Belgian beer. No, you're not. You're drinking well, my I champagne. Well, I had a Belgian beer. <laughs> Stella, <laughs> Stella That's Artois. Like Belgian beer. Stella Artois is lovely. It we is. We have Stella Artois. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, gorgeous. I yeah. like that. Yeah. Oh, you know. And apparently there's only four ingredients. Did you know that? In a Stella Artois. <laughs> Turn it there's over. Only four Look ingredients. at the ingredients. Stella Artois and Orange Artois. Uh, they don't list the ingredients Ooh, in the beer. They no do there. over here. It would be hops, water, <laughs> uh, Have you not seen malt? that billboard? I don't know. No. What? Oh. I think I'm going to go back to my southern accent now. I think I've had No, a... no, don't, don't. No. It's There's too many accents going on right now. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, and I'm going to... And then gonna... I, I could get Queen of Hearts over here and she could just accent this place. There we up, go. Yeah? She could. Yeah. She's good yeah. with the accents. I think my... Is, is being it? driven crazy by people with accents, though. No, I like accents. Oh, you do? Okay. <laughs> I'm trying to think yeah, of a cool one that I can do. So after we're do done, things. after we're done talking about David Tennant here, I'm quite sure that we'll go and talk about David Tennant later this evening with my brother. Oh no. Oh, oh nice. lovely. Does he like David Tennant? Yes, yes, he does. <laughs> In the same way? No, no, he does not. I hope <laughs> that would be, be awkward because hey, then I'd have to beat my own brother. Up. Talk about a Scottish that, accent. That is, talk about a Scottish. Oh yeah. Um, we we'll talk about a guy who's got a <clears throat> Scottish accent. When we had the flu, we watched a bunch of Doctor Who, and they had uh, at the end of the disc there was the um, kind of documentary that he did about Doctor Who, and Mike didn't realize that David Tennant was Scottish. Yeah. Until he heard him talk, that's, and that's then he was like, amazing. "Oh my God, that man is Scottish." I knew he was Scottish, but you know, till I till I saw that, I didn't realize I hadn't noticed that his Scottish accent wasn't there. Just and then how I heard him Scottish. And thought, oh yeah, <laughs> it's like, <laughs> oh my God, you're Scottish. It's not just kind of Scottish. It's about that. Really Scottish, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. I should He's get some lovely. whiskey. He was, he was in a really brilliant program a long time ago called Taking Over the Asylum, where he played this uh, teenager with um, with bipolar or something. Or oh, no, it was a schizophrenic, and he was brilliant, and his his accent was gorgeous. Very, really, really Scottish and just gorgeous. It was amazing. So you have to look for that one. It's fantastic. Oh, look. A lot of the stuff that I'd like to see with him in it isn't available in the States. Is, I have a question. Is this is this a part where I start talking about David Tennant's balls? Because no, I'm so sick of hearing you, about David Tennant. You apologize <laughs> for all of your David Tennant ball comments. You're not going to bring back the David Tennant balls. But if you'd like, we can change the subject from David Tennant, and I'll try not to okay. talk about it for a little while. Well, just one more thing, though. I think, you know, okay, there's, been a, there's been a bit of slagging about David Tennant's balls, but I don't know, Jill, would, wouldn't you think that they're lovely? I'm sure Bell? they're I think lovely. so. I think they'd be really well, nice. Nicely shaped. and Nicely shaped. A bit Scottish, and that you don't really yeah. care what they're like if they're Scottish balls. You yeah. know, I mentioned a contour map, I yeah. was thinking. Yeah. Haggis. Yeah. Little haggis. In yeah. <laughs> oh, little haggis, that's horrible. That's a horrible thing to say about someone's <laughs> genitalia. Well, they'd be, they'd be small. Little they'd be small haggises. because they'd be under a kilt with no underwear and with the wind up there in Scotland. Yeah, you don't want me around men in kilts. It would be kilts. shrunken. Very small. Cami around men in kilts in is a bad combination. It is. It's Shrunk. not. Yeah. I, I'm a kilt flipper and I can't help myself. Are you? You would be busy over here because there's kilts down yeah. in Wales. I'm I mean, a kilt it's flipper. A, it'd be a full-time job. Yeah. I have a friend that when they got married, uh, she was Scottish. And she made her her husband and his entire, you know, what do you call it? Like the wedding party, the male wedding party. They all had to wear kilts, and yeah, I flipped Groomsmen? up a couple kilts. Yeah, groomsmen. groomsmen. I I I flipped up a couple kilts at the wedding. Or posse would also do. <laughs> yeah, the posse. But you know, wear a kilt. They have to expect that, don't they? Yeah, they it, really do. It, I mean, really... I know when I go out of the house with a skirt on, but. <laughs> <laughs> I felt and bad about it because I was wearing a dress too, and if one of them had flipped my dress up, I would have punched them. I, you know, <laughs> I, I would have. On? But what? Did they have pants on? Or did oh they no! Have pants well, on the one that I actually, I the one one of them did, one of them Hand. did not. Oh really? No. And no. did he? See, he wanted you to flip. Yes, he did. Yeah, he did. And the, the person uh, in question, asked. the person in question was in. Was it the groom? No, I oh. no. Well, I don't know what was under the groom's kilt. I, out of oh. respect for the bride, I did not flip up the groom's kilt. Oh, it was it was. And the groom, by the way, kind of looks like David Tennant. No, he doesn't. Yes, yes, he no, does. He doesn't. Yes, because when I saw if it, he looked like David Tennant, I so would have flipped without, up his kilt, without, whether or not his wife is there. Yes, without the beard. 
No, he doesn't. This was before that David Tennant was on it. the thing. No. Yeah, yes, he does. Definitely. He looks like him. Mike really thinks that he looks like David Tennant, but I don't think that he, he does. does. Trust me. No, but the guy who's, <laughs> whose kilt I flipped up, I wasn't the only person. One of my friends also helped me with the flipping up of the kilt. And uh, then we ran away giggling hysterically. His, his girlfriend at the time didn't appreciate that we flipped up his kilt, but he seemed to like it. Jealous. Yeah, she had a young old. What? Was he young or old? Young, oh, young. Very young. Yeah. He's a, is he younger than I am? Barely yeah. legal. Oh, he's not that young. I was just trying to get a reaction. Yeah. No, he he's but, he's now he's this was maybe six years ago. And he's probably in his mid twenties. Early oh, mid twenties. Yeah, so yeah. that was fun. Joe brings up a good point though. Mm -hmm. Um on your 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 kilt flipping agenda. Yes. Um do you have parameters? Like, you know, would you go, you know, that dude's 70. I don't think I'm going to flip his kilt. Or <laughs> no. Say, no, no, that's the problem with me. It's not that I want to see what's underneath it. I have no desire usually to see what's underneath the kilt. It's just that it's a kilt. I have a desire to flip the kilt. But would you not go, well, he's a bit old. Maybe, maybe I must resist I, yeah, because, no. you know, at some point, I, I'm just thinking maybe you're going to have your kid with you, and maybe oh, some I've, trauma will be induced. I have never flipped a kilt in front of my child. Uh, but what I have to say is, that, to living in the yeah. States, it's not as common to see a kilt. Yeah, it's like people are wearing kilts everywhere, right? <laughs> it's like... <laughs> Although this is the second show in a row that we've discussed kilts, because the gunfighter, he does, he does enjoy That's a good right. kilt. But you didn't oh. tell him you'd flip it. Yeah. I did not tell him that if I had seen him in a kilt I would have flipped it no he'd probably flip you no but he knows now if, he, if yeah. he's gonna listen to this yeah, yeah. he knows so he, he knows that if he's gonna be around me in a kilt he needs to make sure he has some underwear or for our UK listeners pants underneath pants <laughs> pants Nickers. what Nickers. which is it no, well, either, either. Knickers is, is, knickers is, is girls. Clothes. Girls wear yeah. knickers. Oh, oh, knickers. Boys like wear pants. Yeah, it's like panties for girls and underwear for boys. Panties always makes me a kill it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a bit. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. like knickers better too. Knickers is quite funny. Panties is too like panties. Yeah, panties. Yeah. Are like, it's embarrassing. It's like what? That's it's right. like your dad would say panties. Yes, yes, he, he would. He'd be embarrassed to say panties. I think my dad would be embarrassed to say panties. I can't imagine yeah. my father saying panties unless he'd been drinking. What? Yeah. Panties. <laughs> what? I don't think I've ever heard my father say the word panties. No, I'm trying to think no, yeah. if I've ever heard my dad say it, and I don't think no, I have. You, okay, you all have something to do this week. Get your fathers to say panties. I, my goal is going to be to see if I can get my father to write panties on his blog. Cool. Oh, yeah. Your dad, dad has well, a blog. Wow. Yeah. My dad now, has a blog. Be very wow. Account. Yeah, it's That's a good amazing, one, too. He's, really. he's freaking funny. I'm going to look him up. He's, he's not just funny. He's freaking funny. Freaking funny. It's, yeah. Make yeah. him say panties. Let's, chaotic funny. musings yeah. with a K. After, after I took the name Cammy Chaos, my entire family just kind of glommed on to chaos. And and mm. now everyone is chaos this and chaos that. So well, fantastic. Yeah, chaotic. I'm like to start calling my blog Holly's Never Everland, a uh, uh, friend of chaos. Yeah, yeah that's fine. Blogspot.com. Wife of chaos. Lot, but... You are my blog wife after all. Oh, well, that's right. I should take your name. Belle is the blog that's mistress. Yeah. Wow. yeah. Yes, she's my blog mistress. I'm here with my blog mistress <laughs> and my blog twin. Yay. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> it's a whole bloggy yeah. family reunion. Yeah, we did, yeah. yeah. We love our family, we decided. We did. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Good. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, hi, real family. I'm just kidding, totally. You're great, really. You know, um, not at all em embarrassing in the Jesus Harding way. I not at all. <laughs> I heart Jesus. I heart Jesus. I too. heart the heavy parents. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Yes, I don't think that Mr. Chaos um, is is aware of the homely ferret. What? The homely ferret. What's that? The father, the son, and the homely ferret. Okay. <laughs> I, I like that. That's how Joe's daughter prays. <laughs> That's cool. That is what she's learned at school. Oh. It wasn't me. She is so cute. And do you know, I had to be really careful because she weighs, I, I've picked up heavier um, wet clothing. And, um, I, you know, I, 
I am quite strong. And so, um, you know, when I lifted her today, I threw her like 20 feet in the air and went, oops, you know. So, I mean, she just like, she's just this tiny, cute little thing that just weighs nothing. She is really ditty. She is ditty. She's, she's tiny. Yeah. I don't know why. I don't know where it's I, you, from, but it's good. I don't think you feed her. No. That would, that would do it. <laughs> yeah. You have to keep doing uh, it, you see. I give her drinks. <laughs> Not kind of drinks. <laughs> so I want you guys all to listen to something for a moment. I want you to see if you can hear this. Okay. Can, can you hear this noise? Ooh, ow. That is the sound of a chocolate bar being opened. <gasps> it's not just any chocolate bar, though. It's a very <gasps> special chocolate bar. Okay, Michael, we don't need that. Well, I'm looking for chocolate, chocolate bar. bar. It's He's a Cadbury, Cadbury Dairy Milk Bubbly. Have you still got that? Oh, yes, man. we haven't opened it. Joe sent it to us <laughs> in December, and then in January, I couldn't enjoy it. Might have gone off. I know. No, it it's actually gone fine. Off. In this country, I think that's Do we need chocolate illegal. bar music? I think it is. Oh, shit. I'm shocked and appalled. You did so Some well. Some hip hop to the chocolate confused. bar music. Yeah. So, no, we don't. We need to let me talk. Oh. Here, honey, that here. Ha- have a Why chunk. Why is that chocolate bar music? It's that's what happens when you. The Candy Chaos Chocolate Bar moment. Yeah, or if your leg falls off. <laughs> so we've waited. We've waited and waited and waited. We didn't have it in December because we had so many sweets in the house. And then in January, in January, we didn't we, have any chocolate. And you can't say it. You can't say it because we want Bubble Wench to listen, and she doesn't like I'm not that saying topic. why. I'm just saying in January, I didn't have any chocolate for it's a fluffy. reason. It's fluffy. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's very fluffy. So now, and then we realized that, oh, Joe's going to do the show. We need to save that chocolate. It's fluffy. And have it. So, Joe, we're eating the chocolate that you sent right now. Right now. From your hands to ours. This is a taste test. Hold on. It's It's fluffy. Oh. Mm. Oh, it's going Mm. in your mouth. Oh. If you don't like it. Oh, oh, take some more in your mouth, baby. (laughs) Oh. Oh, yeah. A little bit more. (laughs) Yeah. Mm. That's Mm. lovely. I wish we had video. I know. Mm. No, that's really lovely. Oh, my goodness. a bit raunchy. I know. Do you guys need your own room? Mm. Mm. Mm Mm-hmm. 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 Oh, that's... Mm. That's nice. Yeah. <laughs> mm. I, I'm getting a little turned on. Mm. <laughs> so mm. am I. A little uh. more. A little more. Mm. 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 Oh. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, that's good. How about if yeah. I pour a little champagne on it? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> this is chocolate porn, you can isn't it? Talk. Yeah, just it is chocolate It's porn. chocolate porn. Yeah. That's not the porn music. Yeah. I'm sorry. All right, I'm going to have one more bite, and then I'm going to put it aside so I can actually be capable of speech. This is really good. Oh, great. I'll just have to finish up. Mm. Yeah. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah. It should be smoother in the velvet. Yeah. Mm. Mm. It's so beautiful. Mm. It's good. It good. To I'm going to yeah. save a little bit of that for Miss Burroughs, so I'm going to see her next week. Cool. That would be good. What about your brother? Mm. Mm. Okay, I'll give some to my brother. But I've got to give some oh. to Miss Burroughs, because she'll appreciate it. Oh, well, it's really good. Mm. This thank you so much, Joe. Thank you. It's a pleasure. I'll send you some more if you want the bee. Mm. It's nice. This chocolate porn moment brought to you by Joe Dubois. <laughs> okay, enough with the music. What? No, dance. Y'all dancing over there? Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah we're dancing. Yeah. Fact, I had to look around to make sure that he hadn't hidden the webcam in here somewhere because I'm all jiggling. <laughs> oh, wait, that's not on, is it? No. <laughs> Are you lying to me? No, the webcam. No, never mind. I'm not going to make that you comment. Asking. <laughs> no, the webcam is up. I just wanted to make sure it wasn't pointing at me. <laughs> We're working on it. Because <laughs> I was jiggly and dancing, and now I'm done. Now I'm going to move back. I'm going to move on from my chocolate decadence and go back to my piñosa. Oh, th- did you they what? get tiki mimosa. mugs yet? No, the tiki mugs aren't there yet. Uh oh. Is a mimosa a plum? What's a mimosa? What? I don't know. This is a bit where I sound dim. It's a, it's a nice word. What's a mimosa? A mim- you don't know what a mimosa is? I, it's just gone from my head and I thought you said it and now I'm thinking. Okay, so I said pinosa and mimosa. A mimosa is orange juice and champagne. See, yeah, you know what? Oh. I, I've hardly ever had any cocktails. Because over here they just give them rude names and they're not actually probably real cocktails. Um. <laughs> Do you know, you know what I mean? They're just in pubs. Yeah. They just say things yeah, sex on the yeah, beach. Sex on the beach, No, no, that's a cocktail that they have in the States, too. They had that. I once had, like, this... I once wondered, and I can't remember what it was, but 
I was wondering, there was a certain cocktail, and I was like, God, I wonder, oh, if I go to England, can I order this cocktail there, or would they just stare at me like I was an idiot? But what I can't remember it? what it was. <laughs> oh, That's going to be a problem. That was helpful. <laughs> yeah. They, they will tell you to go away. They will. Yeah, they probably, if no, I just say, I don't know what it is. The I can't remember what it was. That is a drink over here. Yeah. It has seven kinds of alcohol. Oh, have we moved on to the random facts yet? I think we should. Yeah, okay. Well, oh. we're, we, we've decided, you know, we're going to go against the... Oh, first we have to ask, uh, is, it, uh, is it May May? This was a Belle uh, question. Yeah. You go, Belle. <laughs> okay, yeah. Is it, is it a May May, a Mimi, a Mem, or a Meme? A meme. Or a meme. Oh, 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 oh. Well, if you ask Mr. Chaos, he'll down. tell you that it's pronounced meme, but it's not by any any stretch of the imagination a meme because the meme is some sort of universal truth I think is what he said no you yeah you, you want to know what I a meme is I thought it was all about me me but I always say me like, me like a me me because I think it's dumb because yeah, it's, it's all not about me, me 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 exactly so I call it a yeah. me me are you talking about a me well, that makes like those more quizzes sense, actually. Yeah. well the quizzes have nothing to do with yeah. me yeah we call them me a meme is like a taken from a gene Richard Dawkins Who's over there? Uh, in oh, August? the science yeah. Christ. I've had five drinks, and you're going to start talking genetics? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, no, no. The I'm, selfish gene. That's what I'm trying to catch up. I'm meme. pouring number three right now, Holly. But I don't know what it has to do with blogging. Seriously. I haven't really had five. I've had, I, I'm on my third. Oh, I got to tell you. Okay, now I picked up this thing when I couldn't remember the freaking list that was somewhere in my car, or but but not. You should so have just emailed me. I would have shelf, sent it to you. And it's Glava. Now I'm going to have Joe read this thing because she reads it so much better Glava. than I okay. ever could. Oh. A Do smooth and unique music? taste experience, a subtle blend of spices, the finest scotch whiskey, and just a hint of citrus best enjoyed over ice. Now, wouldn't you want to drink that after she's read that? Did not that sound awesome? Joe needs to have her own show so that she can get really close to the microphone and talk to people yeah. like this. This is not that kind of podcast. <laughs> or Who says? Is it? Dang it. <laughs> yeah. But the fact of the matter is, even though I've poured that liberally, <laughs> liberally into Dr. Pepper Zero. That just sounds wrong. It does, yeah. It does. It does. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it right. sucks shit through a straw. Really? I mean, it, and it sucks it in a very violent way. That's sad. <laughs> no, it's not good. <laughs> Did you get yourself I any amaretto? Joe. No, I didn't get amaretto because uh, here's the thing. And what was I like? Was I like an insane person or what? Yeah, you were like a mad woman. <laughs> yeah, because uh, we got to Tesco. It was like. Seven was it? Yeah, it's my Tesco. Yeah, it's it's it's, it's my Tesco, my Schmesco. Yeah, it's my personal. It was her local Shmesco. one, and we didn't even know. She called us at the end, and she said she could go out in her garden and shout at us, and we would hear her. Well, I would have loved to have known that an hour beforehand. But anyway, <laughs> I had two children who are normally lovely, but I would have loved to have them not been there at the time. And you know what it's like when you're really tired at the end of a long day meeting up with new blog friends and you're oh, trying yeah, to pick totally. out the best liquor ever and the two children are going, I'm gonna run up and down the halls and I'm gonna pick I'm gonna I'm I'm who knows, I might throw liquor on the floor. I don't know. And can I have this <laughs> and will you buy me that? And can I have that? And I need that chocolate. And please can I have those crisps right there? And I'm just like, children, go the fuck away. I hear can I ya. say that? Hallelujah. Say <laughs> yes, yes you can say that on the show. Yeah. yeah. Well, I did. I wanted to say that to them. I was insane, wasn't I? Yeah, you did really well. I would have exploded. Yeah, I did want to explode, uh, but I, then Joe would have had to have picked up all the pieces. Great and job. Yeah. It would have been minging. That would have been. <laughs> minging. It would have been <laughs> grim, wouldn't it? Minging and grim. Very grim. <laughs> Do you not have grim? We have, uh, no, well, I, we have Grim now in Wales. I know. I, I didn't. I didn't. It's Grim up north. Grim Is up it? North. It's yeah. Grim up down north. In Wales. <laughs> You're fine. I'm learning all sorts of words Cammy, I can say. What the fuck are they talking about? <laughs> They're talking. Minion is a great word. They're speaking if English. Minion, it means it, it's, it's foul. It's, and if somebody's minion, they're a minger. Yeah, they are it's a minger. A minger. But what is, what is, I think is that like a fucker? A I mean, what? It's like if something's really ugly or just horrible or kind of think of a person who's a yeah. minger um oh jade goody 
Jane, oh, Jane, Jane Goodall. And she's a bit of a slapper as well. Do you know what a slapper is? No. Do you have slappers? A slapper you is have like slapper? a tart. A, a woman of loose morals. A slut? A, a, a slut, yes. Or yes. a whore. Kemi, do we have grim? What's grim? Grim. It's a word. Grim is, like grim means like is, morbid or sad. From the English sad. language. It's, no, it's, it's not, English, not it's so, nice. No, it's, it's hard. It's, it's horrid. It's harsh. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uncomfortable. Depressing. depressing. Why don't you okay. just say hard, uncomfortable, it's and depressing then? <laughs> it's grim. Like, no. If it, if it's Shut up. I'm getting a vocabulary. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. a grim day. Or if your life. code isn't working very well. Oh. Your code. Are you code? Do you have code? Do you have code up there? Code? Do you have code? I thought she said code. She said code. Yeah, no, code. You said code. Yeah, you know. like I if you're you a software code. engineer, for example. Oh, maybe you your code. Oh, we have code here. We have code. We do have code. We have Cammy code Cammy just doesn't deal with code. My my code is grim, isn't it? Her code was grim. Do you know her, her YouTube problems are WordPress's fault? Yes, they are. Damn oh. you, WordPress. But it's not yeah. me somehow. No. I know a lot of I WordPress could... people with YouTube problems. Oh, do you? See, I, I keep asking, but so I don't really know anyone else who does WordPress. Mm. But it, it, I thought it was me, and I'm really glad it's not. Yeah, that's that's the good thing. Yeah, so I, I thought it was just me. I helped by not helping. You know how and often I, love, I will say yeah. that I pink puffy heart something. Whatever, whatever is. Do you have pink puff, puffy heart there? Do you have pink puffy heart? Whatever is the yeah. opposite of pink puffy heart. That's how I feel about WordPress. Um, um, dark, dark. Well, they'd be grim. Dog poo. Dog poo. Grim. Dog poo. Oh, do we yes. have dog poo here? Dog poo squares. Dog I, I dog yes. poo square WordPress. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That is fantastic. Cool. We what? have created something. Well, you've created something. Yeah. Dog poo we square. No, yeah, we, we were there. <laughs> we gave the dog poo. Yeah, you guys yeah, have I have a vocabulary poo. question. Uh oh. Vocabulary? Do you have grok? A what? A grok. Do you have grok? Oh, I know she's rolling her eyes. Yay! Do you have grok? No. Oh, it's what very popular among, you know, it's like, it's like, hey, you know, I can't grok this code right now. I, I'm, I'm trying to grok this. It, it, it's, it's, to, uh, can you get, provide the definition? Cammy to chaos? fully comprehend and feel the understanding of. Yeah. Did you grok oh, what he was saying? I can't get it. Is it just like saying, I, I don't get it? No, it's like saying I complete, if you grok something. Then you're saying uh -huh. I completely understand and, and oh, can right. incorporate that. If you don't grok it, then you don't get it. I've never heard that. No, I haven't. You no. made that up. No, that's not real. <laughs> no, because I said it one that? day and Cami Chaos was very pissed at me. She was like, "Shut up, oh, that's stupid. I hate hearing people say that." It's right. not a real word. Yeah, and then he thought I thought he was stupid because I didn't understand what it meant, but I don't think he was using. It's like it from probably. Robert Heinlein or it's something. It's a Heinlein word, isn't it? Yeah, oh, it's a okay. Heinlein word. Yeah, I don't even know the book that's from. That we found today that there's quite a few words that that we use that that you don't hold even and you, you oh yeah you no like Mardi Mardi I never what? heard that before today. If someone's Mardi, Mardi's a fantastic word. It means it means moody and whiny and and they've got a big chin on. What do you Ooh. say chin on? I know some people that I could use. <laughs> Why to do you people that make word? up words over there? Stop it! It's 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 a really old word, but it's a dialect word. So, but you said you, when we were little, you'd call someone a Mardi Git or a Mardos, which Ooh, is yeah. just perfect. And it's just, I, love I can't it. think of a better word. How do you it's spell it so I can Mardi. use it on my blog? It's Mard, Mard. I have done a blog post about the word Mardi, but a long time ago when I was first blogging, and, and I think Kaiser Chiefs have got a song called Mardi, which is great. So how, so do, I, like how do I spell it? Kaiser Chiefs. Spell Say it. that again. Spell it for me. Mardi, M A R D Y. Dan will know Mardi. I'm so excited. Mardi's fantastic. I'm excited. I'm, that's my new word. I'm going to use it. So you can say, don't be so Mardi. I'm going to use or it at least such twice a Mardi next week. Cool. What was, a, what was like a bad Mardi. word that Martin had? Other than the two ones and the ones we bleeped. The bad word, didn't he have something? No, all the bad words that Martin had <laughs> were words that were in English. Like American okay. English or but words. He, but he speak. also taught us about um, do you have win and fail? That's not an oh, English thing. That's fail. a gamer thing. Yeah. But that's uh, epic words. Win. We have epic win. Epic win. And Cammy is made of cherry coke and win. Yay! Oh, Joe and Belle, they are made of the finest win from the finest win makers. No, no, that's wrong. 
That's wrong. It's got to be something and win. Yeah. Yeah, it has to be something and win. So they, they can be that. made out of kava and That win. was fail. Fail. Yes, that you was fail. epic fail, Holly. Epic fail. I epic do fail. not fail. <laughs> Try it again. <laughs> Holly in Ireland does not fail. Holly, try it again. It's I, something and win. Flip flop. Flip flop and win. That's me. Yeah. <laughs> I came out today in my pink flip flops because I was yeah. talking so much to Holly oh. that yeah. I just got in the car and drove away. I forgot in that you were in your flip flops. Pink flip flops. Do you always wear I, those I, I out? Crocs, so it was all right. You you are, said what? You're wearing I Crocs? Ah, yeah, you're in Crocs. I, I, can't, I can't talk to you anymore. <laughs> They're, they're like purple Crocs. They're no, I'm me. giving Holly oh. the silent treatment. I'll talk to Belle and Joe, but not to Holly. Everybody wears Crocs. No, oh. I, I don't wear Crocs. I don't wear Crocs. Crocs are for I gardening and children. children. And software developers. Software. No, gardening and children. And software developers. Gardening and children only. And software developers. I hate they look, Crocs. They look lovely. They are very nice. They look like little, they're just gorgeous. Nurse. Yeah, I, I pull it off. They're designed in Crocs. <laughs> no, you don't. Yeah, Do you wear them with yeah. socks? Yeah. You think you pull it off, but you don't. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, so Cami Chaos, why don't you give us a lesson in fine footwear? Cami yeah. likes boots. Yeah, boots I good. like boots. I like boots. Yeah. Mm. I have pink boots. Oh, I have oh black you have pink boots? boots Who has pink boots? I have, I have pink boots. Holly, Holly in <laughs> Ireland, who does not fail. Well, you all sound the same. I love that. No. I love it too. I, I you just. Were confused. You didn't know which of us had them, did you? No, I just heard all the talking. <laughs> you, what you really mean is shush. Hush it. I want to know who <laughs> has the pink shush. boots. I want to hear about the pink boots. I want to know if they're Holly light pink Ireland or hot has pink. pink boots, and they have been commented on at work in the "would you not wear them" kind of way. And I said, um. I, yes, I am going to wear them. Really? What kind of pink boots are they? Are they like rain boots? Or are they like... Uh, no. Wellies. They're, they're like f- fake dockers. <gasps> no, 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 no. Dockers? Sweetie, dockers are pants. Docks. Oh, I always make that... Docks are boots. Yeah, dockers are dock. pants. She made the same mistake I make all the time. Do you call them dockers over there? No. no. Docks. No, we okay. When we're... We call them dockers. When I've had Dr. more Martins. drinks, I call them dockers. That's fine. Um, I, I only I, corrected you, know you because Mike always calls them dockers, and I want to kick him with By them. By accident. Because he, I'm always like, dockers are yuppie pants. And I go, oh yeah, I'm wearing those too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but we'd say docks or dockos. Well, they yeah. were docks mainly. Yeah. We just call them docks. But these aren't yeah. even those. These are, I wish I was a fake dock. Okay. That's what they are. It's I can't afford real Doc Martens because I'm paying uh, my mortgage in money towards my children's shoes. Yes. So yeah. these are the crappy pink boots that I get. And oh, thanks for making fun of them. And oh. No, no, no! I'm not making fun of your pink boots. I'm. No, envious. not you. Not you. Okay. The the my fellow auditors. How many well, holes? I'm not an auditor. What? How many holes? How many holes? Joe, will you please explain to her? They have like it's the holes. How far up your leg do they go? Are they up to your knee? Are they up they're to right your here. ankle? Are they higher? They're, they're the ankle docks. Are sixteen holes? Oh, if they're just holes? up to the ankle, yeah. they're probably well eight hole. It's it's sixteen total, but oh, they call oh, it an yeah. eight hole. Yeah. Yeah, sixteen if you count both. Yeah, in in the states we translate toe. we call it an eight hole. How many holes up one side? So uh, I I have like twenty holes that I wear on a regular basis. They're up to you, like just that below your dirty. knee. Yes, just below Not my mine. knee. Correct. So the yeah, ones that I wanted that when I was so a teenager. Cool. And who got them from? I am, I am not nearly as cool as you. Um, yeah, that's. I didn't buy them for myself. <laughs> Mike bought them for me. He knew I always wanted them, so he brought them home for me one day. They're 20-hole oxblood docks. I, if I hadn't married him and then performed unspeakable sex acts on him, I would have. Uh, I, I might have. Because right. they're really See, now, <laughs> I, I'm married to you. Because I'm your blog wife. And so by proxy, I'm married to Mike. You see? Oh. So really, I think I need boots. But I'm not willing. I like Mike. <laughs> I really, really like Mike. But I'm not willing to perform the uh, the myriad of sex acts on him. Oh, I'll hi, do sweetheart. that for you. Oh, thank God she's got earphones on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, honey, what's this? sex <laughs> Mommy, you're what? going to perform unspeakable sex acts on some man on the Skype? What? Daddy. 
<laughs> Daddy, what did mommy mean when she said? <laughs> God, that was oh, a crap accent, you know the one I just did. I am really pissed off at some random charity that I can't remember right now. Really pissed off. Why did I tell you about it? this? No. All right, so we were in the lobby, yeah? And breakfast time is not the time for this conversation. No, it's there not. Was a, it was not the time for this conversation. <laughs> So, you know, in the ho- in the hotel lobby, they always have newspapers, right? Sure. There was an advertisement fell out of one of the newspapers, and it was an ad from one of these charities that really want to emotionally blackmail you because, you know, I have something left to blackmail. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, and it Feed said... the children. So-and-so, yeah, so-and-so cannot go get some water. Um, or no, if so-and-so goes and gets water, she is going to be raped or killed. Mommy, what's rape? Oh. Oh, thank you. Let's just finish our breakfast first, shall we? Thank you, unnamed charity. I'm going to come kick your ass. Yeah. I don't appreciate that, Can I say that, ass charity? on this program? Is there some, You can't say... I'm not going to say the word that you can't say. I found one swear word that, um, that Mike will beep out, and I'm not mm. going to say it because he'll just it, beep it. Because you don't like it. I don't like the word. It's a word I don't like. What right. Does it, what does it start with? I'll tell It's... I don't like it. He'll beep it. I don't like that. I don't that. that I Thanks for the extra the work. <laughs> no, he has to beep something. <laughs> no, you say it rhymes with blunt. That's yeah. how I never have to say that word. Oh, yeah. that's so yeah. I, You know what? I may not bleep that. Don't bleep it. You're fine. You can, I allow you, you, it. I allow your, you not to bleep word. it because it was the example of the worst obscenity, the one obscenity that Cammie really can't abide. Yeah. And yet you and me are the same on that. I think yeah. there's no reason ever to say that unless you, maybe you're a medical person and you really need to talk. But you would... <laughs> 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 Excuse me, doctor. What's wrong with Mike? I have delivered over a hundred babies and I have never found cause to use that word. <laughs> Did you say, oh, Mrs. Smith, I really need to tend to your blunt. I just need to get this suture and stitch things back together again. You've never blanket stitch. You've never, no one's ever asked you, where is the problem with me? And you've never, ever said, it's in your blunt. (laughs) No, no, I haven't. Yeah, Yeah, that's, that, that, just. It's not a nice word. Saturday, May 3rd, the night the podcast died. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you think yeah. this is okay, killing the podcast? Let's go back to random facts. Oh, yeah, the, the whole point of that meme thing is mm-hmm. that, you know that seven random facts or eight random facts or whatever the frick night it is, yes. count whatever. Yes, the random yeah, number okay. of random facts, uh-huh. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, well, we thought we should come up with random non-facts about us. For example, Joe had a very good one earlier. There's, there is a random Lies. lie about you, but I can't remember. So I'm gonna have to make him with one now. Yeah, that's, that's fine. fine. Okay. Um, I've never, ever, ever. No, no, no. It, oh, I it, have. You have. I have once knocked a hedgehog. <laughs> nice. Okay. Nice. That, that's a good story. Do you starter. want to know what I heard? I once snogged a head shark. No, a hedge, hedgehog. Oh, oh, a hedgehog. Okay, I I heard head shark. Okay, so it's Joe once you, snogged you, a hedgehog. Wait a minute, you slept with Ron Jeremy? What? No, a hedgehog. No, a hedgehog. And what I did, have to tell you, what did she like do with a hedgehog? Time. She snogged it, made out with it. Yeah. Okay. Had yeah. relations with. Okay, Ron <laughs> Jeremy, Tom. the famous American porn star, is his nickname is the hedgehog. So oh. I'm assuming she was oh, in no. porn with it, Ron. Yeah, yeah, she has also also snogged Ron Jeremy. There you and, go. My dad. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah. This is in the tradition, by the way, that in the tradition of it is illegal to manufacture what? It's illegal to manufacture lawn darts in the United States of America. Yes, we're paying yeah. homage to that by coming up with exactly. our own. Oh, I have a great random yeah. fact about me. Would you like to hear it? I yes. would love to. I was a virgin when I married Mr. Chaos. <laughs> I still am a virgin. I was a virgin when I married Mr. Chaos. Oh, we were married earlier this evening. 
Joe and Belle and I. Oh, I was so sad I wasn't there. there. And, and, and we were married by a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> It was a virgin, 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 or a virgin, virgin. Yes, an emerging virgin, virgin. That's right. Yeah, yeah. She had bad hair though. She did. Um, she did have bad hair. Yeah. The purple was like good. A yeah, and sensible <laughs> shoes. <laughs> so yeah, wait, wait, yeah. wait. Now we have we have a random fact about me. Come on. A random fact like about you, oh, Holly. Would you like to share a random fact about yourself? Me? <laughs> you, Holly. Yeah, okay. The random fact about me is that I used to fly airplanes around uh, Boston Logan Airport when it was called Boston Logan Airport. And I used to, I used to poo out the window. <laughs> and then fly around and catch it. Yes! Fly around and catch it. I was really, really good at it. Um, I just want to freaking bad for making that up off the top of my head. <laughs> I just want to make it really good. clear. I've just shut my laptop so that if I spit pinosa all over it from laughing, it'll just damage the cover and won't actually get in the that keyboard. That doesn't sound right. Spitting pinosa. <laughs> that sounds now. Odd. Now, Bill. Bell. Yes. Yeah. You want a random fact about me? Yes. Well, you do know that I'm a pygmy warrior, don't you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> From a little-known South American tribe, they actually worship me there. I am their goddess. Nice. Um, it's largely because I'm only three foot six, <laughs> <laughs> and sometimes I find that the bone through my nose gets in the way a little when I'm drinking. It, it catches on the rim of the glass, and you hear it chink. That's like awful. That. Wait a minute. I, That's I, an I, awful hardship. Hang on, I need to do something really quick. Just hang on. I just need mm, to do something. It is. The Cami Chaos Strange Love Program <laughs> celebrates diversity of our South American audience. <laughs> Thank you for listening, South American audience. <laughs> Love you from the Cami Chaos Strange Love Podcast. Did we also lose the Boston viewers? <laughs> so wait, wait. Now let's go through the viewers, Not the really, listeners that we've the, lost. Who landed on them? <laughs> We've lost Boston because Holly's pooed on them. <laughs> We've lost the hippies because Cammy Chaos doesn't love the hippies. We've oh, yeah. <laughs> Although I'm trying to get a hippie to do my show. There's a hippie that I like. What? What? A hippie? Does it have to be hippie You've been talking or to hippies? Chick? What, huh? Does it have to be hippie or maybe just a hippie chick? There is a hippie chick. Who's, who's been reading my blog, who I like, and whose blog I read, and I'm going to try to get her to do my show. Yeah, do it. That'd be cool. Yeah. I emailed she her and asked her to do it, and she ignored me. But she'll do it. She's going to come around. What? I know. How can you oh. ignore Cammy Chaos? I'm Cam. Doesn't she know who I am? <laughs> I'm Cammy freaking Chaos. I think it's time to put out a hit. I'm Carrie for Denise. If you're listening to me, you will do the show, Denise. At some point, you will do the show. Freaking yeah. hippies. And she can't hide. No. No. Yeah. No. And she now I said her name on the air. She has to do it. Do yeah. it, Denise, because we will listen, won't we? we oh will. my God, yes. And she should do it for the flowers. Do it for the children. Do and it for the do it for yeah. the flowers and the children. And for clouds. Do it for the vaginas. And the yeah. oh, No, 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 Christ, we no. Miss Burroughs. <laughs> Miss <laughs> Burroughs does it for the vagina. Like it. Yeah. Miss yeah. Burroughs and Miss Burroughs will do the show again. Miss Burroughs and I are talking about having a super secret blog chick slumber party. Oh yeah. That's and if we cool. do that, then we will actually have an episode of Strange Love that will not be hosted by Mr. Chaos and I. It will be hosted by Miss Burroughs and I. Hey, nice. Yeah. Cool. Mr. Chaos nice. will not be allowed in the tent. Because he hasn't got a vagina. That's right. Well, he has one, but I keep oh, it in my pants. Yeah, it's not his. <laughs> yeah. Well, it, it's not his own. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's, it's not, not normally part. attached to his body. Yeah, it's not attached. Well, I hope you all know that'd be weird. Yeah, it would be. <laughs> yeah, a little bit rude. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, rude, yeah. He left the room, so we're having girl time. Is there anything you guys want to say without him listening? Although he'll listen to it later um, when he's editing. Oh, oh, oh um, I, I just found out what 
what period meant. Oh, you didn't know As what in, period meant? No. So I just thought, oh, they say period a lot. That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't realize it they was talk a full about stop. Menstruation. Yeah, because mm. over here a period is a period. Oh, yeah, I think I remember when you found that out. Period means stop. It's the dot it's at the end yeah, of the sentence. Yeah, but I never made that connection, which is really dim. What do you call it me. there? No. I just thought that you were all a bit mad. What do you, call, went, what do you call it Because they religiously say full stop here. Really? We don't, yeah. we don't, do we? Do we? We do I, say full stop. I, yeah, yes, it's noticeable to me. So yeah. when you're Careful teaching that. children to write a sentence, then you say, and at the end of the sentence you put a full stop or a question full mark? Stop. Yeah, a full stop or yeah. question mark or yeah. a comma. There's nothing or... else to call it. Hmm. But period, not period, I, I had no idea. Yeah. And I said that to, to Mr. Beaufort and he laughed at me. Did he know? He thought I was... Yeah, he hearts. knew, but I just didn't know. Queen of hearts. No one explained it to me. I have Queen to have hearts. things explained. Oh my gosh, it's a bit sad. Does she actually <laughs> respond when Holly yells Queen of Hearts at her? No. Well, she would if she had not <laughs> got headphones on. Oh. Yeah, she, she yeah. would, wouldn't she? Probably? Yeah, she did, because she's used to that now. K is so like, used to being called K that if you say K, if you're anything with the letter K, if you actually say a hard K, she always turns her head, yeah? What she's, did you call K when she was um, imminent? <laughs> when I was knocked <laughs> up. Is that your you question? Want- your what? When I was pregnant? Yeah. yeah. Um, well, until we found out that she was her, we called her the baby. <laughs> no, we called uh, Queen of Hearts Shark Boy. <laughs> Talk shark. about frickin' therapy we're going to have to pay for. <laughs> yeah, we called her Shark Boy. And because they wouldn't tell you in Belfast, they would not tell you. So what, what? did you all, what did, I don't understand the question. So okay. we called her the baby. And then after we found out she was a girl, we called her by her name because we named her. The morning we yeah, found we named- out we were having a girl, we gave her her name. Right. We called Miss E Plumbob. Plumbob. Plum yeah. Nice. Because when when we went to see it, like the first scan, she was the size of a plum or something. Yeah. yeah. And then, you know, like in the Waltons when they go, good night, Jim Bob. <laughs> <laughs> so Mr. B used to say to my stomach, good night, Plum Bob. Oh, nice. He's so going to hate that I said that. Yeah. But I don't Does care. he listen? Hey. He might. Mr. Oh, Chaos, did you yeah. call, when Kay was in utero, did you call her anything special aside from her name? Or the rock monkey? We called her the rock monkey occasionally. Nice. No, but I do rem- remember the gynecologist ca- calling your vagina a blunt. With a C. <laughs> All the time. He and she like- was a woman too. Oh no, I thought you were going for the Wilford. Br- I had, I had two uh, OBGYNs. Actually, it was an entire practice, and they shared patients. You had your primary OBGYN, and then you had uh, to meet each one in turn in case they were on duty when you delivered. So the two primary OBGYNs I had, one of them looked like Wilfred Brimley. Do you, Holly, you probably know who he is, right? Wilfred Grimley. Brimley. Brimley. That's Brimley. an old dude, and he kind of sells, what does he sell, oatmeal? He sells yeah. something. He sells what oatmeal, he and he also does hey. diabetes commercials. Now, Cammy, uh, your kid's going to be fine, and uh, here's some oatmeal. You need he to eat actor. some oatmeal. He was an actor. And watch your diabetes. <laughs> and, uh, He's just like an old grandpa. And dog on it. He was a, you know what? He looked like mustache. Santa Claus yeah. with so no beard. Like He's template grandpa. Santa okay. with no yeah. beard. Say, okay. say again? Santa with no beard. Uh, That's right. Yes. Yeah. And then oh, the other yeah. one was this little tiny petite woman with the tiniest hands ever. Thank Bob she had the tiniest little hands ever too. They don't you find like I mean having had two children because that, those hands wound up in your. They always have the biggest bloody hands. Oh yeah, and they midwives just you don't. know the surgeons yeah. are just naughty. How much do you love midwives? They're and amazing. not just because there's one in the room. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're fantastic. They are the and most look, fantastic creatures. Fine. Yeah. Hands. Yeah, look, uh, you know, you wouldn't mind, you know, so I, I don't want to think of that. I've got shovel hands. <laughs> no, they're not. They're not no. Short fingers. fingers. What? Does this hurt? <laughs> yeah, it's a disadvantage yeah, for a midwife. Short fingers. Yeah. Do you know when I was getting my placenta removed? <laughs> so no, wait. Oh, I have a question. No, no, let her. You finish and then I'll ask. Okay. When I was getting my placenta removed, that dude reached up in me, and I swear he was touching, like you know, my vocal cords. Yeah. I'm like, what the fuck? That that that, that canal doesn't even go up there. What the fuck hey, are you doing? Holly, you know? So they had to go up in you to get your placenta out. They did with me as yeah, well. she was ten weeks early. So, oh my god! My do, you guys are the, the, 
you're the what? first people I've ever spoken to that had to have that. Kay's, um, for those of you who have not given birth to children, this is incredibly gross. Stop listening for a moment. For those of you listening to the podcast, and I'm talking to the men right now, please forward <laughs> about two minutes from now. Cammy's about to share a birth story. Unless you're a real man and you yeah. can listen to such things. Mm. I think yeah. men should listen to these things. Yeah. They you should, know, but you'll through. never have sex again. So I, uh, I had a okay. difficult delivery. They were really concerned about K. I I was induced early because of my uh, elevated blood pressure. Um, I'd been on bed rest for about a month, I think, at that point. And it was time for the baby to come Should out. Should I play the music with this? No, please oh, no okay. music. We need silence. <laughs> silence well, behind me. Cocktail music as you talk about the placenta. You no, know. but I'll drink. <laughs> so, like a thing. Yeah. <laughs> so go ahead. Get your music. Oh. So I was in labor for three days off and on because I wasn't taking well to the induction. Cammy Chaos was in labor for three days. <laughs> <laughs> no, because he values his testicles, and he knows I would have removed them. Would have removed them. <laughs> so anyway, on the third day that I was hospitalized, the induction finally took, and after 45 minutes, I gave birth to Kay because I was frantic. I thought something was wrong. She popped was out. Popped out. Of she the blunt. 45 minutes? 45 minutes. I, I had her out in 20. Fuck you. Sorry, you go ahead. You go ahead, honey. This is you. Fuck you, you Holly. Fuck you. Um, <laughs> and the epidural? And the, oh, oh, here we go, Holly. Did you have an epidural, Holly? <laughs> I fucking did. I fucking hate you. Um, <laughs> my I didn't want one. My epidural? Oh, no, wait, an epidural. Yeah. No, I didn't have one until the second. The, which one is it? Which one is it? The spinal block. I had a spinal for my worst, for my first one. I had an epidural for my uh, my second one. Wow, mm. my God, I almost said. Yeah. Ooh, Don't ooh. say that. I you know, he can face. bleep. But <laughs> so anyway, the epidural, for some reason, worked from my navel to my breasts. Oh, uh, that's wrong. That is from weird. From the navel the wrong to the breasts. Yes, it didn't go well. Wrong and, half and then the of the body. And the anesthesiologist disappeared. Useful for breastfeeding. I was very angry. Yes, it would have been useful for breastfeeding, but I wasn't breastfeeding. I was giving birth. So <laughs> yeah, that wasn't so good. <laughs> so yeah. so when do when that? Kay came out, breastfeeding comes oh, later. You need to stop, or I'm gonna smack you. <laughs> I'm just helping out the other audience members who may not be. I'm glad you told me that. <laughs> so when Kay came out, her cord was wrapped around her neck, and the 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 doctor. This sucks. It did. Pulled the cord from around her neck. And then all of a sudden, like, her face and the faces of all the nurses got really grim. Oops. <laughs> grim. grim. Were they Marty? <laughs> they were Marty and grim. And I couldn't figure out what was, was wrong awesome. because immediately... Epic fail. Epic fail. Actually, no, it was just fail. If it was epic fail, it would have been worse. It was just fail. Oh. So, so then they handed the baby to the pediatrician because we had a pediatrician waiting in case there was something wrong. And they started screaming. Well, okay, they didn't scream, but they started asking for the anesthesiologist because they wanted to sedate me. Mm. Because mm. the placenta was stranded inside of my body. I had that. With no, uh, with no, uh, what you call it, cord. <laughs> oh, I had that on the ward, and someone, someone said, "Do you need a torch to the nurse?" And that kind of worried me. Oh man. <laughs> They wound up with a humongous <laughs> needle full of Demerol in my thigh, and then my doctor was like up in there pulling it out. I have a canary. Oh, with one of those miners' hats with a torch on the front. <laughs> did you have like, you know, did you have a team of gerbils? <laughs> yeah, gerbils with little hats on. Yeah, wearing kilts. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, were the gerbils wearing kilts? Is that what? <laughs> I'm going to go flip them up. <laughs> they just they just flip not themselves. They were a little They bit, do, they're really good. They that were way. a bit loose. Yeah. Oh, well, they slappers. all are, yeah. They were slappers. Yeah. Yeah. So, we did we didn't touch on uh what uh, wait, did we get all the way through your thingy there? Yeah, carry yeah, on, yeah. Carry yeah. On. yeah. Doctor Sorry. C reached up inside of my woo hoo. Inside of You're my vagina. Oh, Miss Burroughs will get on your ass if you don't she say what they you. reached up in there. Yeah, yeah. Miss Burroughs, say I it. love you. They reached up inside. They, she reached up inside of my vagina. <laughs> it was a whole team of experts. Up to my uterus <laughs> and extracted case placenta. 
mean, yeah. it's horrible, isn't it? It is not pleasant. And did they say to you, do you want to see your placenta? No. It was in Mine pieces. Me. Mine was and in went, pieces. Yes. <laughs> it's amazing how many people no, do. You said, <laughs> how rude. How no, rude. They, I was so high. I was so high on the... Uh, the Demerol that they shot into my thigh that they wouldn't even let me hold Kay at first because I was like a kite. Give me my damn baby. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Give me my Fucking damn baby. now. And then oh, Give I have me to tell my the- damn baby. I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm gonna just- mm, <laughs> baby. Tastes like Cadbury chocolate. <laughs> Wait, I'm going to tell you guys the nurse kicking story. Epic fail. I'm going to tell you the nurse kicking story very briefly. I'm going to apologize in advance to my cousin Mai. But my epidural didn't work. And shortly after I gave birth, I really wanted to get up out of bed. I couldn't stand being in the hospital bed. So I said, I need to go to the bathroom. I don't really think I needed to pee. I just wanted out of the bed. And they wouldn't let me. So I said, I need to go to the bathroom. I need to get out of the bed now. And they said, no, you've just had an epidural. You can't walk for a few hours. We'll bring you a bedpan. Yeah. I said, I don't want a bedpan. I want to get up and use that bathroom. I can see it from my bed. And they said, what do they say, Mike? Uh, well, I was just thinking that your your <laughs> boobs being numb had no bearing on you going to the bathroom. Exactly. At the point. So I said, I said, I'm numb from my navel to my tits and I want out of the bed now. And uh, the nurse humored me and she said, okay, fine. You can kick into my hand and we'll see if you have enough leg strength to support yourself. (laughs) Bad idea. So she tested my first leg. She had me kick into her hand and I kicked and she was surprised by the strength. (laughs) As she picked herself up off the floor. No, then she she said, well, let's check your other leg. And I kicked so hard that she fell on the ground on her ass. (laughs) Nice. Um... And then I was happy. Can I go to the bathroom now, <laughs> bitch? <laughs> she let me go to the bathroom. Yay. This is how Clint Eastwood would go to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> this is how freaking Angelina Jolie goes to the Holly, bathroom. Holly, you know. Holly. <laughs> yeah. Sweetie. Yeah. Sweetie. I'm tougher Listen. than Clint Eastwood. Listen, sweetie. I'm tougher than Clint, Angelina Clint Jolie. Clint Eastwood would be standing when he was going to the bathroom, sweetie. Oh, That's the difference. God. Don't patronize my yeah, wife. You know what? Uh, Don't patronize my wife. Thinking of things that could be sucked. Oh. Oh. <laughs> and there it went. What's the word for what? it? Rude. So rude. Yeah, I'm rude. So rude. Yeah. Very rude. Yeah, that's okay. You can be rude to my husband. I I allow that. Because he knows I still love him. Yeah. Yeah. You know that, right? Yeah. Yeah, and we have a secret um, dialogue that happens not within the blog through other people. What? Yeah. It's very cool. You and Hall? Yeah. Have a secret dialogue. Because I make comments about Holly on the on the podcast oh. and things. And then yeah. it gets back to her and then it gets through other channels and we and never actually have to speak secretly, directly. Secretly, you get That's one right. episode with a clip Do you know, Doc, I actually had a picture taken of me this week. <gasps> and now it was of me. No. <laughs> Better. Damn it, I wanted to flip In it. In front of a porn shop. Oh yeah, see this is an example of the uh, the secret yeah. messages. A Actually, P O R N shop. Yes. P-A-W-N. Now I had to get one of my coworkers to do it. Yeah. <laughs> I work I work in a firm of auditors. And one of them Okay, well, actually, to be fair, they're not the, the the gal that I asked was not a fellow auditor. I don't think they would do it. Really, I don't. What was she? She was um, well. She was gonna be um, my good friend who is in. Um, she was publishing. gonna be your good friend, but now she knows you too well. <laughs> she was good. Yeah. No, no, she broke her foot. Ow. She may have broke her foot, or she's. Holly has oh. no she's friends with broken feet, so. <laughs> One that you made run yeah. around the park because you don't love her. No, I made her. That's right. Yes, I made her run too much. Too much. You think she just didn't want to go to the porn shop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, some people will go really out of their way not to take a picture of me in front of a porn shop. So I had to get my fellow coworker who is also on my IT team, and she said, "Oh my god, oh mingin." Yeah, she did. Yeah. Mingin. Oh my god. Like with her mouth closed like that, yeah. yeah. But she's a nice gal. You'd like her, you know, if you want to come over and see her. Although it's not really a reason to come over. No. I'm a reason to come over. No, no, no. You're not Joe's a reason, to come, reason over. to come over. Because you are going to come over and you're going to visit with Miss Burroughs and I. And Miss Burroughs and oh, yeah. I are going to have a grudge match. 
match SmackDown to decide whose house you're staying in. <laughs> nice. All of the girls. Nice. All of the gals. Yeah. yeah. All. I love you both, it. but I do love a grudge match. Yeah. I do love a good proper SmackDown. Yeah. I we might I, have one later. I Who cook knows? more than Miss Burroughs does. Yeah. I you cook, what? I cook more than Miss Burroughs does. I thought you said you smoke more than she does, and I'm like, what has that got to do anything? No, I quit smoking a long time ago, and she doesn't smoke at all. No, she doesn't. No. But we we never, to get back to this, we never covered... Wait, no, I... Wait. Is that a Porn shop. Wait. wait. Porn shop I totally lost my train of thought there. Your like, friend taking a picture of you in front of the porn shop with her mouth closed. I think I, I think, no, I think that was all on that. But why did you have... Joe shop. doesn't know why I had. Oh, just uh, Joe doesn't listen. Joe what doesn't it, what, love what me enough. Not listening to. She listens sometimes. Oh, because I, Mr. Chaos. She listens. Listen. She just listen. Listen. Oh, listen. Oh, No, Mr. Chaos said that that he doesn't think they have porn in Wales. Yeah. Oh, in Cardiff so specifically. Yeah. In Cardiff yeah. specifically. Yes. Oh, there's so no now it's a new series, even. Every time I see a porn shop in Wales, I'm going to take a picture of me in front of it. Please do. Just, do you know what? Miss yeah. Burroughs and I have never had our, we never had our um, vibrating lunch trip. What? We haven't gone, and I'm not going to disclose the date, but this week, Miss Burroughs and I are going on our shopping trip. I don't believe you. <clears throat> I know you don't believe me, so to prove it, I'm going to have, we're, we've invited a third person to go with us. And okay. I'm going to ask her a to take... A safety, a chaperone. Miss Burroughs and I yeah. so don't need a chaperone, but, but Mr. Chaos might uh, hope that we have a chaperone. Are you sure? Um, I love you, Miss Burroughs. You might need a chaperone. That's true. We might need a chaperone. We Do you could think get you know what you, uh, what, what you might purchase, or is that getting a little too... No, no, no. I've researched exactly what I want to purchase. I, I just want to go see if they have it in the store to look at. But... We've right. invited a third person. I'm going to have that person. Hi, Jolene. I'm going to have her take Hi. a picture of Miss Rose and I in Hi, front Jolene. of the store. Hi. <laughs> right. Okay. Yeah. Now, Holly. Yeah. Are but I you... can't tell yeah. you. Oh, wait. I've got to further the information. The day that Miss Rose and I go on our shopping trip, we are going to meet in the bookstore that my brother works at. But my brother will not be working. Nice. There. He will not be there that day. Oh yeah. No, and Holly, it really, it's, 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 it's. That's almost as as good as I have peed in the same <laughs> as Joe. Yeah. You've peed in I the mean, same <laughs> Joe. <laughs> Not in the pizza. In the <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you have <laughs> over there? Yes. yes. Yeah. It's disgusting. It is. <laughs> we had it tonight. We get all your. Oh, Mr. <laughs> Chaos, you don't have to beep it. All Mr. Right. Chaos is afraid that because I said the name of that company and then I followed it with saying it was gross that he has to beep it. Well, we beeped that other company. Yes, because I puked in their bathroom. Yeah. I know. <laughs> no, but we also said it was disgusting too. Yes, you don't have we to beep, beep it. Beep it's fine. In the toilet. That's yeah. Right. That's yeah. Right. We weed in the toilet. That is a, an entirely appropriate yeah. place to wee. And they were nice toilets. The, yeah, they're not bad toilets they're at not all. Bad. Not beep, beep, yeah. beep. beep. Oh. <laughs> we should get the thrower. Beep beep. I know the thrower is asleep. I can't beep. believe it. Oh, well, I have a question. I have a question. Look, okay. Beep. So, uh, do you guys have Mexican food there? Beep beep. Yeah. Oh, now wait. Now no 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 no. I was thinking about so this. Don't have it. No no probably no. Not like proper. not we have, we not. Have our version. We have yes. <laughs> not very good food. restaurants that have food that is of Mexican theme yeah um but nothing that i would say now that's a mexican restaurant so you don't have like I'm a, tacos my, my ass there no. tacos i mean chips, I, 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 am, I would of the three of us in yeah. this room i am she the expert know. on mexican food i yes. think i can throw down and there are no mexican foods in great britain I, I, I'm throwing down there there are no there are no mexican food restaurants in great britain i'm sorry that's what I was wondering. And I, I was just thinking about that. I was thinking, I bet you they don't have chips and salsa and tacos and burritos. You, you can get that in restaurants, but we haven't got probably really yeah. proper. In there, where? There, there's, a, there's, a, there's a place called Chiquitos. Chiquitos. And that's all right. Is that a you fast food or, or just a restaurant? Or? No, it, it's a restaurant. It's a reasonably priced restaurant. And oh. it's, 
I I would give it a passing grade on Mexican food. Okay. Yeah. There's not. There, I think there probably some in Nottingham, but there's none in Mansfield. Really? Mansfield does not have a Starbucks. We and we don't have a Borders. I've never been in the Borders. There's one in Berlin. Joe has never been in a Borders. Wow. I've been We've in a Borders. Do you have anything? No, it's crap. You know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, no, what's there? I, I, other than your house. There's Robin a Pizza Hood. Hood. Is we that, have Robin Hood. Isn't oh, Joe's yeah. house in that? Yeah. And Lord Byron. Why did Lord Byron choose? My God, that's weird. I don't know. Oh, Lord he Byron was from there? there. He's, well, no, he had a house, like, up the road, kind of, from me on Newstead Abbey. Next door. Ne- yeah, ne- next door to my you house. You are Lord Byron's yeah. fifth niece. Um, fifth I'm child. his fifth niece. <laughs> You're his... Twice removed. Oh, The right. interesting thing about that is, he was he not gay? gay? He was no, gay. No, was no, no he was everything. He was everything. That's yeah. why we said he called him with Byron the fishes. short, and it was actually true. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was. Because he yeah. liked a bit, he had lots of peacocks on his place as well. Yeah. I have peacocks <laughs> at my house. You? I do. Yeah. yeah. But you don't love them, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Not in that way. Whereas Lord Byron, probably, <laughs> maybe, if Kay <laughs> ever comes to any of your houses, <laughs> she will not go near them. She's terrified of peacocks. Who is? Kay. Kay's Why terrified. she won't watch they NBC? They are a bit alarming. They make weird noises, don't they? Mm. Mm. But they are, yeah, they're wandering exactly. around on the ground. Yeah, She's like, afraid of them because we went to oh. the zoo once with a friend, and the friend fed the peacock, so the peacock followed us, and Kay thought that the peacock was chasing her. They have geese as well, and geese do that. Geese are scary. Geese are freaking evil. Ge- they are, and they've got them at New Stubby as well. I of, don't ge- think they want visitors. I think that's <laughs> no. what it is. Geese in Sutton Park, lots. Yeah. They're wow. nasty. And yet, there's no mixer did. in that drink. There's nothing in it. That's why. That right. is just pure alcohol. Yeah. Slam it. Slam so the alcohol. We're just drinking antifreeze. It's all right. Just slam Joe it. Joe just giving me antifreeze. <laughs> Drink it. Drink it down yeah, quickly. And looking at Don't listen to Cammy Chaos. Cammy Chaos is not a good influence on others. When Cammy Chaos says slam it, you should actually put the drink down. Slam it. <laughs> We have a little sort of needing to wrap up and go issue. So do we. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> we said it Not first. That we don't love you. We heart you to pieces. Only um, we're we're going to have a uh, an, a a driver issue in a minute. Okay. It's my fault, Cammy. I'm sorry. It's my fault. I've been having a bit of um, well, one or two issues in my family just mm-hmm. lately. Mm-hmm. I don't know whether you've seen on my blog. No, but, um, because I'm a bad person. It, uh, that's okay. You don't have to. It's fine, honey. But, no, I um, want to. I just haven't read it. I haven't added you to my reader yet, and I don't actually read anything that's not in my reader. <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> it's just um, things are a bit um, uh, difficult, I yes. think. Yeah. <laughs> um, and I, I'm going to have to go to bed because I haven't slept for about two days. I want you Mr. to sleep, Bell. Belle. He's up. Oh, yeah, and the captain. The captain. The captain. <laughs> yeah. Who is lovely. I met the captain. Dude. Captain yeah. Ahab. Yeah. He's lovely. Yeah. Well, Although, I, yeah. I was yeah, about to I, do my wrap up. Do you have something to say? We're all going to say one thing that we do that the queen does not do. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. The queen. Well, I'm just going to go with the thing that I came up with earlier. Yeah. The queen does not come out of the bathroom and go, oh, yeah, and have a really good butt scratch. She does not do this. How do you know? I, I just know these things. If I were the queen, I would do that. <laughs> yeah, well, okay. that's why you're not the queen, though. I mean, I love you very much, but you will never be the queen if you do that. No, I won't. It's true. I have just taken an enormous, beautiful dump in the toilet, in the loo, and uh, now I'm going to scratch my private parts. I think it would be one would scratch one's private Oh, there we go. I'm sorry. You know, I'm not from around there. Jeez, so. Mr. Chaos. I'm an anus horribilis. <laughs> The queen would not keep her mobile phone, cell phone, in her bra. <laughs> that is yeah. right. She would good call. Neither would oh. I. Nice. <laughs> I wish I had my camera. Um, I heard, I heard that she's all like uh, high tech and everything. They've gone real high tech. 
Oh, queen? Oh, fuck. Yeah, she has the she best keep sea it in her bra. Color. Yeah. <laughs> She's not going to have vibrating breasts. And as a matter of fact, this oh, is interesting. Maybe I should keep it in my bra. On Twitter. <laughs> it's not that vibrating. Can we go breasts. for it. <laughs> she, doesn't have, she doesn't have vibrating breasts. Um, the queen would not hand, do a handstand in a thong. She fucking would not. <laughs> <laughs> but Prince Philip probably would. He would. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. I'm pretty pleased with those. Are you pleased? I'm pleased. I have to add that the queen would not have a pinosa in my basement. How do you oh, know? She would not. <laughs> Although that is the least rude of How do you know? Of with adequate that. security, she might come down here and like... Oh, the queen would so not have a pinosa yeah. in my basement. Oh, Cammy, chaos is great to be on your podcast. <laughs> One would love it. What next, would love a pinosa. Next week, the queen of England taco? has a pinosa in my basement. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. I'm this week, the Queen's sponsored by Treasure Licious. <laughs> exactly. Treasure wait, wait. Licious. Yeah. Okay, this is how we're going to end it. In order to end the show, I want everyone to do their very best sexy treasurelicious.com send out. Okay. Okay. Start with- send off for Okay, we'll start with Joe. Yeah. Oh, I don't know what to say now. Just go, treasurelicious.com. Display your treasures on the web. Treasurelicious.com. Display your treasures on the web. Very nice. Nice. Okay. Treasurelicious.com. Display your treasures on the web. Show us your new. Oh, I just realized it's not display your treasures, it's expose your treasures. And I should have realized because the sticker is sitting right in front of me. <laughs> oh, hang on. Oh, yes, because I have I have a sticker I need to blog to. Okay. Expose your treasures our... on the web. Treasurelicious.com. Yeah, okay. All right, Belle, you go. Yeah. Expose your treasures on the web at treasurelicious.com. Nice. Oh, that's a freaking keeper. Bye, everybody. Yeah. Good night. Bye-bye. Sweet dreams, girls. I have this other job, you know, with telephones. <laughs> Mem call you. Yeah. yeah, you know. Oh, you're the one. <laughs> That's me. I always keep going, can I have that British girl? She's so sexy. Have you heard of Belgium? <laughs> yes. Good night, folks.